applause for Ada Sharma. And it's absolutely, um, I think, uh, a beautiful moment for me to figure out that she's also my country cousin. Um, she's half Tamil, half Malay. She's a Palagat. Tamil Malayali. Tamil Malayali. The Palagat borders, yeah. Tanni and stuff. Awesome. No problem, Ada. No problem. So, uh, hi, hi. Can you hear me? Yes. Ada, I'm going to come with, start with very straightforward and I think questions that people are mostly looking to asking ke, aapne ye picture mein role kaise kiya, ye kaise kiya. But Ada, my question to you is very, very straight. You are a pretty woman. Is there any typecast worry that you have? Because, you know, right. like typically we would see Ada Sharma in certain roles. Um, so for me, I'd like to believe what you've seen of me on screen till now is probably 2% of what I'm capable of. I'd, I'd really Hello? think so, yeah. Ah, ah. But I think I'm very fortunate that I started off with a debut like 1920 where mm -hmm. that was the first time people saw me. I had not done any ads. I had gone for auditions but not got any ads or any work mm -hmm. before 1920. So the first time people saw me on screen, they saw me with like black teeth and, you know, dark circles. Ah. And I was like talking in a man's voice and, you know, like, <laughs> you know, being possessed and no, I was possessed if you've I not know, seen I know, I've seen it, I've seen okay. it, yeah. So, and I had those scary lenses and stuff. So, I think that helped because then after that, uh, I can never look so bad. So, even if I'm outside and I say, okay, today I'm, you know, sweaty or there's no makeup, I'm still like, it's okay because I can never look that bad. Right. So, right. people will always say, Are she looks nice because they've seen me look like that. Wow. So, that way, I think the pretty typecast thing, you know, has sort of taken care of there, but... Um, I think I've only shown 2% of Correct. what I'm capable Correct. of, I would like to believe. However, uh, nowadays since there's social media, I think I do whatever I feel like over there and put out stuff that I want to. Um, that maybe a film has not given me a chance. But in the past year, in the past six months, I have done uh, four films which I think this year will be, uh, I would like to believe my time to shine because I got to do stuff that I've um, never gotten a chance to do before. I got to do movies where I got to speak in different accents. I love mimicking accents. So I got to speak in different accents. And if you're okay with giving us a sample, if you're not, then don't. That's perfectly okay. For a I mean, sample. it would be like a real struggle. I don't really know if I should like. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, I'm worth it. So like, yeah. Yeah, this sounds like a lot of my fake friends. They, I just mixed up this. a two in case anyone's going to catch me there. So. So what are these four films, Ada? So, can you talk uh, about it? Yeah, so okay. four of them I can. There are two more, but those. Uh, ah, but the ones ah. I can talk about. Uh, so there's this film called uh, The Kerala Story, mm -hmm. which is based on uh, the true life of um, uh, these girls. So it, it's a nice journey. It starts off from when we're in college, in nursing college. Mm -hmm. And it goes up to uh, where I have a child. And uh, it's, it's a traumatic film. I get raped and we go to Afghanistan. And uh, it's based on this real life of this girl who's in Afghanistan jail right now. So uh, that's one film. It was a really heavy film, which I really enjoyed doing. I felt as an actor, I got to really stretch my potential and Brilliant. do a lot of stuff. Uh, then uh, there's Commando also, which um, I think uh, I do. That's a film I do for the audience because I know people are like, you know, that the masala film that I get to do, uh, all the action. I think it's really fun that they let me do uh, an action movie where I'm not the damsel in distress and I get to beat up the boys. Henna, isn't I that, think that that's very, uh, yeah, do you do that in real life? Mokka milta hai no, toh, no, damn. No, <laughs> I'm, I'm totally the opposite in real life, I think. Um, but uh, in, in Commando, I get to uh, beat up, people up, yeah, I get to beat up the goons that the hero is also beating up the same goons. I get to beat up those same ones. And I don't have to say like, bachao, mujhe bachao, yeah. you know, <laughs> I get to beat up my own goons. So that that's fun. Then uh, there's this movie called The Game of Girgit, which is, um, it's like, you've seen Mardani, no? So it's like that. It's like a cop and a... Um, and then there's this other film called uh, Tibba, which uh, uh, I can't really tell you about my role because I'd give away the suspense in that. But uh, yeah, that's another very interesting uh, crime thing. You'll really enjoy it. I hope. I hope we've acted <laughs> nicely enough that you enjoy it. So. No, no, I will. I'm going to quickly open for questions because I know a lot of you are dying. And before I come to asking her about preparations of the horror characters that she's very popular for, <laughs> koi sawal puchna chahega Hindi, English, any language, just raise your hands, volunteers, feel free to pass the mic. Tum log sab sirf photos le rahe ho Adha ka, koi sawal puchna chahega, <laughs> bilkul be farm puchye. There is no show of hands anywhere. I think they only want photos. <laughs> yeah, I think they only, yeah. Is that Mikhil? Mik, Mik, Savala, thanks, yeah. 
can can you see huge round of applause for Mikhail Masale, national award winning film director, who is now embarrassed because I love doing that to him. Hi, Ada and Priti. Hi. 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 So <coughs> my question is again: We live in a country where every third person wants to be an actor. Yes. So. <laughs> uh, uh, Against makers as directors, we uh, get to choose our stories. You know, how how much is challenging as an actor because you can only act what is given to you. You know, so what is the challenge of an actor in a regular life when you're not acting? Okay, if you can just answer in detail, because I'm sure there are a lot of actor aspirants also here if they right. eventually want to. You know. Uh, That's my question. Firstly, I will agree to you. I also believe this. I believe that around 98% of our population in India wants to be actors for different reasons. Some who really want to act. Some people for the money. Some people maybe for the fame. Some people will say, "Wow, you just have to wear nice clothes and walk around." All some for for different various reasons, uh, and to each his own. But uh, yeah, the challenges in daily life will be like everyone else's. Like. I don't know. I don't like onions in my food, but I'll say don't put onion, and onion will be there. So, there are silly challenges that you have in real life. As an actor in the industry, uh, uh, to not belong to a film family and then be in the industry, it's tough to, like you said, choose the roles that you want to do because um, you get say this much, and you have to choose from this. So either you be like me, and a lot of times I've said I don't want to do only. I'm not doing this because I'd rather not do than do. Uh, but yeah, I've done some uh, movies where I've said, okay, let's make the best of this. And sometimes you get god awful dialogues. But then I tell myself as an actor, let me make this so convincing and uh, make it so believable and make people really buy it. So we try our best to infuse life into it or make those lines uh, really, really work. But for an actor, it's so nice when the dialogues are really good. Because then it becomes so easy if the lines are written so well, if the script is uh, etched out so well. And if you're given a material that's, you know, flows nicely, but you're right, a lot of times it's not. So that is the challenge of how to, but then that's an actor, no, to make really <laughs> terrible stuff sound nice, maybe. Mikhil, does that answer? No, no, I am good. I am you're good. good. I Ask know. for the public. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyone else has a question here? Yes. It's difficult to spot you people. There a mic. Huh. Hello, hello, well, um, welcome, ma'am. Hi, thank to Karnavati. you. And uh, my question to you is that after doing a certain amount of films, do you think training helps an actor to better themselves? Uh, I think training in any uh, field of whatever you're doing is always helpful. If you're a dancer and you've trained, it is very helpful. Uh, if you're an actor and you're trained, of course it is helpful. Though I think the training that comes while being on set is, uh, is the best training you can get because even if you, wherever you've gone to film school around the world, one thing that they don't train you is when you're on set and uh, for example, abhi, uh, wala scene hai, you have to cry and uh, I have to look there and uh, the person I love is dying, so I'm ready to cry. Then Vahan say, you can hear him say, Aray baby ka light kato na! Kato light, light aara, light aara. Aray, aray hair aara hai yaar muh pe. Avan meta cut cut. Okay, so I'm ready. I'm like, filled my eyes up and, Aray wo baal muh pe aara na, wo hatao na. Avan meta ma'am, ma'am wo lipstick thoda, wo lips pe dal sakte hai kya? Wo thoda touch up karo na. Okay, so I'm ready. Okay. Okay, three, two, one, action. Ha, okay. Left eye say, huh? just drop the tear from here, huh? because we're lighting. Aise hua. Okay. Okay, huh? but very naturally. Huh? So you enter and you say, okay, okay. Ready, ma'am, ready. Five seconds, mein, huh? because I want to cut the shot where after five seconds, fir aap na, wah. Okay. Uh, so I'm ready. I'm looking there. I'm ready. Are shine aara face pe. One minute. Kaun noise? Kaun? Are bhaar se koi? Are kaua? So there's like, ka, ka, happening over there. Then they're like, are ye scene baad mein dub kar sakte na? So I'm like, <laughs> okay, ready with that. I'm, <laughs> okay, ha, okay, ma'am. Wo dub karenge na? Ha, thik hai, thik hai, dub karenge. Uh, then I'm like, can I have a sip, sip of water? So I'm like, uh, I'll just have a sip of water. Okay, I'm all ready. Uh, thik hai. Ma'am, lunch mein kya karenge aap? Uh, lunch ke liye, uh, we'll order something. So I tell my team, I'm like, ha, don't put onions uh, in the food. Just make sure uh, onions nahi hai. Ha, ha, thik hai. 
वो मैनेजर का कॉल आया है सिक्सटीन को आपको जाना था ना वहाँ पे हाँ ओके ओके यू आर रेडी ना फॉर योर शॉर्ट हाँ ठीक है ठीक है ओके आई कैन फील अ पिंपल कमिंग अप हियर आई नो इट्स फ्रॉम द लेफ्ट एंड दर्ज अ लाइट हियर एंड दिस पिंपल इज गोन टू शो एंड देन यू कैन सी दम लुकिंग एट द मॉनिटर एंड द डी ओ पी सिंग वो क्या है उठा है वहाँ पे ना उसके फेस पे वो थोड़ा uh, वो दबा सकते थे आई वर्क इन मूवीज वे देन बिफोर लाइक अ रियली इंटेंस सीन आई हैड द डायरेक्टर कम एंड से इट इज़ नॉट लुकिंग नाइस ऑन योर फेस नो यू आर वेरी फेयर स्किन डोंट कीप इट नो दिस पिम्पल वाई यू आर कीपिंग नो इट इज़ नॉट सूटिंग यू डोंट कीप इट इट डजेंट लुक नाइस डोंट कीप ओके रेडी एक्शन सो दैट ट्रेनिंग यू डोंट गेट इन एनी प्रोफेशनल प्लेस बिकॉज इन प्रोफेशनल प्लेस देल कीप द एनवायरमेंट परफेक्ट फॉर यू एंड देल से ओके नाउ एक्शन and then you can get your emotion out and you can perform your scene brilliantly but on a movie set you should be able to probably mute out everything else and be so involved in that shot at that time and believe that character because i think on screen even that much of fakeness will not will show and then the audience watch it and they say are isko acting nahi aati hai what rubbish yaar what she does aise kaun karta hai aise kaun rota hai aise kaun hasta hai because i think anything from a laugh to a tear to any emotion fear um fear i think is tough comedy uh, anything romance anything at that time maybe you've had an argument with your co-star or you hate this person you're working with you think this horrible person but you have to look at them like i love you i i love only you and i have eyes for nobody else but you but uh, yeah so that training i don't know if you can formally receive anywhere however training i still think is very important thank you ma'am thank Why, you that was brilliant ada i mean i think we all were like a शॉर्ट देगी कब ये लड़की मतलब real i try to really believe and do otherwise i'll cry like me Correct. and i like to cry as the character or whatever laugh as that character is but uh, yeah so i like to think that training uh, you receive when you're on set i've learned to mute out things now wow i think in in general in life also that's a very interesting in life i've not learned it yet no, yeah, no. I, i don't know how to do mute it out i don't know people. how to mute out people yeah in real life but on on screen i'm able to yeah i'm no. sure that will translate eventually other fussy to fussy a very yes. interesting film i think a lot of people remember your character strongly standing out is there something from that film that was a new experience for you ya fir something that you were like yaar nahi aa rahi to maza nahi aaya i mean of course on screen the translation is what we view um, Yeah I think um uh, Hasi to Fasi when I did of course I loved the role and all I had given a lot of auditions then and uh, you're saying like pretty face but I think as an actor na aapki jo self confidence hai uski dhajiya to roz urti hai to finally I think uh, as an actor I've always felt oh god you know fix your craft and this thing because looks I don't know I've never had a thing of because as an actor you're uh, pin pointed every every flaw of yours is like exaggerated every day and discussed so for hasi to fasi i gave four months auditions for my eyebrows okay i was selected for the role and they thought i acted very well i had done that if you all remember there's a wedding scene where i'm walking around and he gives me the he removes his um uh safa and it was very hot it was like some 40 degrees when we finally shot that nose ring kept slipping but anyway on the audition um, uh we did this they liked the audition and everything however they wanted a new girl Okay, to launch, Dharma wanted to launch a new girl, and I was not new girl. I had done a horror movie, yeah. which was like, "Ew, you've done a horror movie, like, ew." Okay, now I couldn't take that away, and I'm very proud of the horror movie I did. But uh, well, uh, I told them, you know, maybe we can lie and say that I have a twin sister who's not been launched and launch her, maybe. Wow. But uh, I gave them those ideas because the, I can't change that. I can change other things. But then my eyebrows were a point of problem. so they made my eyebrows really thin really thick shortened it lengthened it arched it got it lowered um and they did all sorts of things till it became that thin line like that if you see hasito fasi have these strange thin eyebrows like that they are arched and anyway 
so then i finally got selected for it and uh, i remember that uh, i was so excited you know wow i had i got to do that song shake it like shammi it was the first time i got to dance on screen in a hindi movie in a dharma movie i was so excited and then when the song launch happened they told me oh actually you are not launching the song siddharth and parineeti are going to be going on dance india dance and launching it so i was i was like oh my god so that was heartbreak number 1 heartbreak number 2 was on the poster my name wasn't on it and uh, again this is not saying it as cribbing i'm just telling you if you're an actor these things are things you should um, i if you hear someone else's story maybe if it happens to you you will be like you know because now if it happens i'll be like eh, it's fine but at that time it feels like the end of the world no your name is not on a poster of the movie but even the stylist name is on the poster of the movie and uh, the only shot of mine in the promo was a back shot of mine in a sari but you couldn't see there's just my hip so uh, that was the only shot because they said we we can't uh, reveal it or something so uh, yeah so that experience was uh, oh, i was like oh my god i got to do the movie and i'm not in the trailer and i'm not on the poster all that happened but simultaneously i did my telugu debut which was with puri jagannath in uh, this telugu movie which was this big hugely mounted movie and he's like the karan johar of south so uh, he makes these uh, commercial movies he decided to make a movie which had a girl's role as important as the boy like a love story and uh, that movie had songs and no dances but it had a lot of acting in it and they mounted me so well and uh, i was getting so much bhav <laughs> from telugu at that time and our movies released the same week so i was in hyderabad promoting uh, that film and uh, the accolades i got for that i also learned as a person i used to keep saying no no i'll do only hindi because i don't speak telugu okay so i should learn a language and then do but then i told myself no it's easier to learn a language and do it if you know you're getting uh, all that you want maybe in another industry so hasi to fasi really taught me to open my mind to all industries that uh, and i really enjoyed doing the film i thought vinil was very cool as a director uh, i thought he really got out emotion so subtly from all of us and the whole team was great the experience was awesome and then i also told myself if i'm getting to do it in another language why not so uh, yeah that opened my mind to a lot of other languages also and then i started doing movies in all languages so ada you just said something very interesting in the context of the telugu film you said that my role was as important yeah. as the hero's role ada i want to ask you this question that i'm, I'm loosely using the term popular mm. because yes. we have a lot of cinema we often tend to not look at regional cinema with the same lens ada the role of a female protagonist even today and again this is my interpretation i could be wrong you are in the industry is always playing second fiddle to the hero uska ye matlab hai ki agar heroine badal do kahani to chalegi hi aap heroine ko mat rakho i feel sometimes some movies aap furniture ke tukde ko rakh do fir bhi celebration yes. as much as i loved and i'll be very upfront as much as i loved pathan for me watching it was a moment of rebellion but dipika padukone had only five dialogues oh pathan aha pathan eh pathan that's it her character other than that kamar and all there was nothing else coming out other you are new you know yes. you you're sort of uh, getting there slowly what is it that you face and again this is my interpretation as audience as someone who teaches films absolutely you know, so i i actually agree and it's so sad that i have to make that a thing where saying my role was as important as the guy's exactly. role i have to make a statement like like that's even a thing yeah. but but it's true it has yeah. to be put like that because uh, that's how it is in a lot of movies however i would say i've done both so i can say i did like uh, in telugu i did another film called kshanam yes which uh, had uh, but again kshanam was uh, another movie that i did for fun at that time i was doing an- three other big movies and everyone told me don't do and i was like i will do okay and i didn't have a producer then and it was you know one of those but um, there are both i try now to pick movies where um, you know my role is really nice and i would like to believe that i can push it with this role and you know you think okay only she will be able to i did that for my first film also for 1920 i had nothing i didn't know anybody but i said no i want to start off with a film where i want a really important role i want to be the importance in the film and that has nothing to do with being there for 5 minutes or being there for yeah, course, um, in each course. frame yeah yeah but i want to have some sort of substance in a film i try to pick like that uh, it i wasn't uh, say in the middle i didn't but now uh, i can very proudly say whatever is releasing this year every single thing uh, is uh, uh, not not only the role important it's revolving around um, uh, my character so exactly. i'm trying to pick stuff like that from the options that i have no that's brilliant because 
it's rare so i'm glad people are even making such you know because i still think women yes. narratives are not explored totally i'm doing something else that's written by a woman uh-huh. and we were just discussing a few days back that a woman's perspective um not that i have anything against men or anything men are great however a woman's perspective however <laughs> yeah however a woman's perspective on stuff is uh, so nice like she's got the quirks and the comedy in my character i also enjoy doing comedy where uh, i am not the butt of jokes you know a, a lot of times in comedy the men are cracking the joke on the woman who's like oh like i didn't get it did you just laugh at me so uh, that's not nice but i like to do uh, comedy where i can i can crack the jokes so with commando i'm trying to do that with this other thing i'm doing uh, where i told you a woman's written it so uh, yeah when i get get what you're saying because 12 years into the business of comedy it's still male dominated my audience oh my are God. men the jokes are on me and whenever i try to flip it everybody's like wow either they call me ashleel or they call me progressive there's nothing in the middle for me ada right but i'm glad you're also delving into comedy that so. is and i look forward to seeing more of uh, i hope i hope you find me funny yes, <laughs> in the you. stuff that i'm doing so uh, no, no, i'm sure we will guys any questions for this beautiful woman before i start asking other questions around her films yes please it thoda sa na yahan pe na khade rehe hath agar hila sakte will be nice no even i was not able to it uh, <laughs> i'm an actor i'm 14 <laughs> till i die oh, wow. female actor female actor yeah <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi, Ada. I'm Hi. really a huge fan of yours. Thank you. So I've seen uh, your Instagram posts. Just me, you do martial arts. Right. Like, what attracted you there? Like, it's so fascinating. Thank you. Uh, I've been doing gymnastics since I was a child, and uh, my mum does malkham. So, I think oh. it in the family. She does rope and pole. I do only rope. Uh, for pole, you have to practice yeah. daily, and I'm not. I don't have uh, access to a pole. but uh, it helps if you're um, if someone from your family is doing it my mom is uh, super fit like fitter than me she's and uh, so uh, fitness yeah is something that any way i'd like to do martial arts for commando we were training um, and i learned silambam for it i really enjoyed silambam and then the lockdown was uh, had happened and uh, all of us were doing our different activities whatever keeps your mind sane so uh, i found some sort of physical strain uh, ge- keeping my mind sane uh, in the day i also found it very meditative because when you're doing silambam and you're moving the stick if you lose focus for even one second you'll smash it on your head which i did i have bumps on my head uh, still yeah because if you lose focus at that time no, you had it the same thing with the nunchucks uh, though i started with the padded ones uh, if you're using the actual ones you can break stuff on yourself I just thought the danger of it, uh, along with the meditative thing put together, was a very fun combination of things to do. So for me, it's like a meditation actually when I'm moving the stick and I'm concentrating on that. Uh, so yeah. Next. Thank you. Anyone has any question? The audience that side. No, he sir, ko ja rahi hai. ठीक है. Any questions? No. Okay. Uh, I have plenty because awesome. you are this this <laughs> let's do this. this this yeah because and I'm going to take off from a lot of things that you are saying Ada especially with hasi to fasi when you said eyebrow issues hue the right Ada for many women and men here you know you are perfect beautiful <laughs> they are like yaar mujh mein ye kami hai mujh mein wo kami hai and here you are sitting and saying that you know this is very vulnerable and very beautifully said by you that my question is very pointed other where are we heading when it comes to these definitions of beauty and confidence you know hmm. and especially this this young generation that is completely looking at things in a very linear way ke sundar matlab yahi and somewhere cinema is also endorsing that a majority of now of course right. we're seeing a change we are no thankful yeah, like yeah 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 we also are we are thoda in the right direction correct 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 and uh, i also however cliche it might sound it is in yourself because after that hasi to fasi uh, happened and then i thought and i realized that you know things you have to be okay with yourself maybe i also had a thing yeah i stopped doing my eyebrows after that i stopped i don't go to a salon only i tweeze that say i have a uni brow by the way which i tweeze out by myself my tweezer is kept with my toothbrush every morning so when i it grows overnight you can look at my face and watch my unibrow grow so yeah it grows like a it's like a man's beard it's a full unibrow 
so the tweezers kept with my toothbrush in the morning so after i brush i check in the mirror i tweeze my uni brow out and uh, i go to shoot i don't do my eyebrows it's been uh, four years Aap now karte nahi ho. no you can see it there's i don't do my eyebrows at all so i have thick bushy eyebrows deal with it and be happy now that's the thing so and people will say if you're in the industry people would have things like uh, i have had things your nose is big your eye is big your ha huh, of course <laughs> yeah <laughs> if it was little thinner it would have been nice i've had people say that also so that you're going to get it for everything anyway so just deal with it and um, i think maybe you accept it in yourself and you be okay with it first so that when someone else has a flaw and before you're giving your very important shot when they're looking at the monitor over here and checking you out here don't lose your cool or uh, don't get into a very vulnerable state though i know it's the most vulnerable state when you're in front of I'm the camera i'm sure right but yeah. uh, try to switch off and that's why they say actors are messed up no little bit i think we I all have to be a little that, crazy to be able to do this yeah yeah and how yeah. do you do that because again i'm saying that it's it's young uh, strong women like you who are at least challenged